it's Jim Cooker, and you're watching yet another Daily Flip. And today we're going to talk about mentors. Uh, I'm going to keep this hopefully a little bit short. I'm trying to keep my videos not in the... They've been going mostly in the six to seven minute range lately. I'm trying to keep that down a little bit. Um, you know, tell me, what do you like? Do you like the longer ones? Do you like the ones that are shorter? Um, let me know. Leave a comment. Um, so here, here's the deal. <clears throat> today we're going to talk about mentors. And I have a couple of mentors. I have a, a local person here in Cleveland who's a mentor, who has a big journalistic background. Uh, I have a mentor uh, who, in the online space who um, guides me in terms of online video and online marketing. I have mentor groups that I'm part of where I learn from other people. Um, <clears throat> but I think it's really, really important that you have some type of mentor relationship in your life. Um, so in my example, specifically uh, online marketing, when I am interested in a topic, for example, I'm doing a lot of online videos now, uh, I, I went out and I try to find somebody who's doing that type of thing and, and I, you know, not idolize, but it's somebody who's very successful in there and I go out and I ask them, I, I, I approach them very nicely, I say, look, I am getting into this business and I'm just looking for some information, maybe you can help point me in the right direction and answer a few questions from me from time to time and, um, you know, the, 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 the thing is, is like you can't just send an email to, you know, if you're interested in starting a technology blog, you can't just send an email to Mike Arrington and, and hope he's going to respond to that. The guy gets a couple thousand emails a day. You know, you're going to have to be uh, less, I guess, I don't want to say annoying, but, you know, a lot of people, when they get a lot of emails, it's hard to return them all. And it's, um, it's hard for people to, you know, feel like you're not just trying to get free information. I, I guess the best way to think about it is if, imagine if you got 2,000 emails every day and you had to decide which ones you could respond to and which ones you couldn't. Are you going to respond to the person who's just like, send me how you do things because I want to make money. I get those emails, by the way. Or are you going to get the one that's going to be short and sweet and go, hi, my name's Jim, and I'm getting into the business of starting a technology blog. And I just want to know if there's any tips or tricks that you can point me to or any advice you could give me that will help me out. I realize that you're a busy person, Mr. Arrington, um, but if you could just spend 30 seconds of your time responding to me and pointing me in the right direction, I'd appreciate it. Now, that will probably work, you know, if you take that approach. And um, so the bottom line is, if you work with, you, you get uh, somebody who's an authority, who does, is good at, at doing what you want to do, get, see if you can get them as a mentor and start soft with them, start just being friends with them. And, and then, ask them to be your mentor at some point at some point you're going to have to say look i really need some help and i know we've had discussions in the past would you be willing to help me out from time to time and that's how i've got all the mentors i have in my life i basically asked them i said can i contact you from time to time and you can give me advice about what i'm doing so that now that i have the mentors in my life um whenever i reach a crossroads or a point where I have a question about something, I'm not really sure where to go, I do send an email to them or call them on the phone and say, what do you think I should do? What has worked for you? And I found that it is one of the most valuable things that I've ever uh, done is have mentors in my life who can do that for me. So so look for people uh, that, that can help you with your, with your business. Look for people that can be mentors and um, approach them the right way, uh, nice, and be friends with them. And then ask them for help. It's just... It, any, anything in life, online marketing, life, anything, is all about selling. Everything's a sale. You have to ask for the, the business. You have to close the business. So if you're looking for a mentor, you have to go out and say, look, I'm looking for a mentor. Um, will you help me? You just have to ask the question, will you help me? And people will help you. you know, I answer every single email I get, unless it gets in the spam folder and I lose it. I answer every email and I try to provide people with some information uh, that's going to point them in the right direction. I may only send you a sentence back, but guess what? I'm going to respond to your email. If I don't, then I didn't get it. So um, look for mentors in your life. I think they'll drastically help you with your online goals uh, or any goals, uh, but in the online space especially. And uh, send me an email and ask me to be a mentor. I know you're going to do that now. Um, look. I'm willing to help you out and point you in the right direction. Uh, let's be friends first. You know, Send me an email. I'd be happy to, to give you some advice if I can. So uh, that's the story for today. I'm Jim Kukrul, and that was today's Daily Flip. And look for a mentor in your life. Jim Kukrul, Jim Kukrul.